Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. Eh? Amen. Thank you very much. Let me talk to you fine, Chukun. Hmm? Then you not to worry. I'll be fine. I'll be for you. Yes, Mama. And carry your children. Amen. Hmm? I, know. I know how you feel, eh? Hmm? I'll be fine. Hmm? Don't worry. Hmm? Thank you, Guibo, for me. Hmm? She's taking care of me. Egum. Darling, Mom. Darling, Mom. Egum. 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 Wanabu sonima, ego ibo ngebo, ala pokwa na makao, ego ibo ngebo. Ego, hmm? it looks like I have to stop here. Oh. Hmm. Why? You come to see me, huh? and have you forgotten? You're supposed to take palm kernel oil to mama. Oh, yes, I remember. But... See you. Egon, I need to go to Okoye to see my former employer. Please. That's true. It's okay. Thank you, my love. Thank you, huh? She run along, okay? Yes, I will. I'll just go home, pick the canal and give it to mom myself. It's right? okay. Bye. Ego, my ego. Oh, <laughs> ego. Ego yi bonke mo A pamma chala cha a kuchinye le mo Mwana bo somba Ego yi bonke mo Ala po kwa na maka o Ego yi bonke mo Ego mwa ke go Ego Ego yi bonke mo my princess, good afternoon. My engine just went off. Um, I'm trying to call my mechanic, but he's not picking up. Um, I don't know if you could help me out. I'm sorry. No, no, no. It's just that I was... Uh, but it's okay, it's okay. It's, it's all right. Please, open the bonnet. Gently before you fall, eh? Okay. No, 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 no. What is the problem? You know these cars, you know, they have their ways. Ah. I will check on it and I'm sure it's a minor problem. Uh, my princess, please. Stay in the car because of the sun. Eh? Okay. Please, Thank I will, you. I will fix it. Eh? That could be the problem. But how the battery? How was your day, my princess? <sighs> Hectic, Daddy. Mm -hmm. My car stopped me on the road, and I couldn't get across to the mechanic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hmm. I hope you didn't miss your appointment. <laughs> Daddy, you can't believe it. I almost did. That's serious. But uh, why didn't you send a message so that we can send a guard to come and assist you? Yeah, Daddy. Actually, I was about doing that before a good son of the land came to my rescue. Okay. In that case, I think uh, it is time I got a, a new driver. So Asago is very sick now. So I can be here. Yeah, Daddy. That's mm. nice. I think that's what I need right now. Oh, Daddy, let me be to my room. Oh, seriously, Daddy, you're looking so oh, sick. Mm. All right, now. I'm in my room. Who wants to see you?
Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm better today, my dear. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, Mama. Yeah. I bought some things for you that you can use in drinking tea. Oh, Ego, you go. Do yes, this for me. Yes, you need it. Hey. Thank you, Mama. I also bought some ingredients that you can use in making your favorite masala soup. Hey. Ah, Ego, you go. But you don't need to stress yourself. Eh? When has taking care of my mother-in-law become stressed? Oh, thank you, Mama. No problem, Mama. Let me go and see if I don't know. Okay. Hey, go, Ibo. Let me help you. I thought you were supposed to be in the shop. My brother came back from the market early, so I yeah. was asked to go and make dinner. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. Go, market, go. I know you're surprised to see me. I am because I can't remember giving you a description to where I'm staying. Yes, but I I dropped you off at the mechanic where you used to work before. Remember? Yes, yes, that's true. So I went there and your boss directed me. Oh, I see. It's all right. my princess. Please, please come in, okay? Come in, come in. Let me offer you a seat, please. Um, actually, I'm off to the mall. To the mall? But I came regarding our discussion the other day. Yes. Well, I've talked to my father about it. Yes. And then um, he has agreed to give you a job as a real driver. My princess, you <laughs> can't be serious. I'm serious. He said you should come and see him at the palace tomorrow morning. Oh, this is like a dream come true. <laughs> it's not. It's for me. <laughs> Hey, my princess, you wouldn't know how much you no, have no, saved no, no, me. No, 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 You don't have to do this, okay? You're a nice man and you deserve my help. Thank you very much. All you need to do is wake up early tomorrow and be at the palace, okay? Thank you very much. But you know what? My mother, my mother should hear this directly from your mouth. Mama! 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 Thank you very much. No, 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 no. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Sit down, my son. Sit down. Your Majesty, I must thank you for giving me this uh, opportunity. And again, for saving my mother and I from starvation. You are welcome. All I need from you is sincerity and uh, diligence to your job. That, Your Majesty, I promise you. Okay. Uh, my daughter here, Amara, will now introduce you to that palace. Thank you, my Amara. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Obi, how? I cannot believe it. You will not believe it. What is happening? That of all the able bodied men in this village, those with muscles, those ones that are big, it is me, if I you, that God decided to favor with the appointment of a royal driver. Hmm? Obi. Thank God. It's God's thing. Hey, Rebecca, welcome.
What are you still doing here? Did I ask you to come to the shop and change me while I, I come home to wash my jeans? Yes, you did. So what are you still doing standing here? My friend, carry your foolish self inside and get my food. Before I lose my customers. I greeted your brother and he did not answer me. You don't even bother about it. You should run along now, okay? Go home and share the good news with Mama. Are you still here? Come on, get inside and get my food. Don't want to go to the to go to the house. I don't to I to I I bless him for remembering us. I bless him more, Mama. Do you know something? I cannot wait to resume work. Earn my first salary and make you happy. There you go, my son. Oh, Mama, ego, ego, ego. <laughs> ego is always in my budget. My First in the budget. <laughs> ego, <laughs> Mama, I'm, I'm very happy. Very, very happy. Um, you live in the palace like other staff and go home once a week. But because of your mother's illness, I will extend your day off to two days in a week. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. Thank you very much for your kindness. You are welcome. And uh, lastly, I've instructed my daughter to make funds available to you so that uh, you use it to take better care of your mother. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. Thank you. That's right. Thank you very much. I'll be in there for like an hour or two. So you just relax in the car, okay? Yes, my princess. Here is some money. In case you want to eat or drink anything. Alright? Biscuits. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
So the princess allows you to drive her car? Ah, ah. What are you talking eh? eh? Even the king, I drive everybody, you know? Hey, <laughs> Thank you for hey, coming. It's okay. <laughs> The king, everybody, I'm the chief driver. I'm the royal chief driver. Are you serious? <laughs> yes. Oh, you. I actually took the princess to the shopping mall. Okay, dropped her there, and I went to buy petrol. So I used the opportunity, I sneaked away yourself to come and see your beautiful face. <laughs> <laughs> you know, and then get. Okay. Okay. And I came to give you this money. Money? Yes. But you only just started working, so where did you get this money from? Ha! Oh, Ego Ibo, are you on this? I am the royal chief driver. <laughs> <laughs> the chief pilot, I pilot all the cars in the palace. <laughs> I drive the king, I drive the princess, every car is on the palace. Ah! This is just part of my allowance. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Ha! Obi! I don't want you to... I don't want you to go. Let me go. Let me go. Hey! Let me go before the princess begins to look for me, eh? Take care of yourself, eh? Wait! Eh? What is it? Take it easy before you spoil the lock. Eh? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. Let me go, eh? Let me go before. Ego, 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 <laughs> this is for, I will improve public school if I become governor. Hey, hello, son. Hello? Yes. How are you, son? Mm, I'm great. I'm great here. I'm great here. You see? It's great to know. It's great to know. Are you serious? Are you serious? Wow, wow. <laughs> That's the greatest news I've had today. Hmm? When exactly are you coming back? Is that soon? Oh, <laughs> okay. Your brother is coming back just now. Oh, is that
father. Her name is Barbara Osai. That's right. She's a lawyer. Hmm. And we graduated from the same university back in the UK. That's right. Hails from this local government. Whom we sued to be precise. Okay. And um, she's the lady I want to marry. Is that? Oh, I'm happy to hear that. <laughs> oh, my daughter, what is your other name? Onyekachuku, Your Majesty. Yes. Hey, I'll prefer to call you that. Onyekachuku, eh? <laughs> That's right. You're welcome to my palace. Thank you, Your Majesty. So, your parents are back there in Mwisu? Yes, Your Majesty. Both. Just my mother. My late father, Dr. Sai, left us a few years back. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, Amara. Yes, please take her to her. This is lovely. How come you knew my size looked perfect? Oh, come on. Have you forgotten you sent me lots of pictures? Plus, your brother was always on my case. Mm -hmm. Buy my sister this, buy my sister that, buy my sister this. I'm really glad you like them. <coughs> now I see. I love them. They're okay. fine. Thank you. You're welcome. Love this. This is lovely. Yeah, particularly, I love the color. Me too. This, I this love it. The sequence, everything is beautiful. Fine. Mama, Egoamaka, money is good. Mama, you need to see the kind of respect the king and all the chiefs in the palace give to the prince and his fiance when they came. Mm -hmm. It was too much, Mama. Hey, I wouldn't want to Mama, at the point, I felt, oh, why is it not me in his shoes? Look, Are you serious? In fact, Mama, if you see the young man in question, the prince himself, mm. eh? he is a complete definition of the word royalty. Mm. Mom, ego amaka. Ego amaka, Mama. Good morning, Mom. And one day, this morning, we attend your palms. I'm you. I'm you, Mama. You see, my sister, you are a very beautiful woman. A woman that can appeal to any man, including the high and mighty. But you see, sometimes it pains me that you're still here, with no reasonable man to call your own. But uh, I do have a man who loves me and who wants to get married to me. Are you serious? You I mean you've met a man that wants to marry you and I don't know? Why are you pretending like you don't know I have a relationship with Ifai? My friend, shut up. I am talking money and you're here talking nonsense. Are you not even ashamed of that beggar? He's not a beggar. That doesn't even have a decent job. Of course he has a decent job in the palace. All right, tell me about it. Has the king employed him as a boy boy? He's not a boy boy. He's the king's official pilot. And, and his employee loves him. There you go again. Boy boy again. Wait a minute. Is that what he told you? Royal pilot. Which airline does he work with? I'm tired, I need to go and sleep. Why won't you feel sleepy when you are allergic to hearing the truth and taking advice? Go and sleep. Ego, my kego. 
You know, she's the first child to her parents. And the mom is aware she came back yesterday, but had to see us first. So I want to drop her off this morning. Mm. And that's alright, that's alright. Uh, but uh, make sure she comes back soonest. Yeah, by the weekend, she'll be back with us. So I'll come back to us. Then that's drop her off. Thank you. Um, uh, just a minute. Please make sure you go with your guide. Well, I'm fine. Yeah, security. Seeing the face of the food, you know that it is what the waiting. Eh? <laughs> hey, <laughs> hey. Mm. The prince requires your presence at once. Hey, hey for me. Tell him I'm eating. He said immediately. Can I eat at least half of You know you don't keep the prince waiting. <sighs> Mega. Where are your shoes? Sorry, sorry sir, I was... I took them off. I was rushing to come and open the door for you so I couldn't wear them. Daft. So you can't do two things at the same time, eh?
Thank you very much. You're welcome. Just call me when you're less busy, okay? Alright, sure I will. Alright, take care. Prince, please, I'd like to ease myself. What's the meaning of that rubbish? I'm off this car! I have a meeting to attend! Oh my, my prince, please, I'm very, very pressed, please. Shut up! Are you mad? Oh, you even talk while I talk! I'm sorry, sir, I'm sorry, sir. Just... Oh, I should sit in here and wait while you go ease yourself! Must I move this car! Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Tell me, tell me, what is it that couldn't wait till I come down for breakfast? Um, Obi, it's about yesterday. I think you should please forgive the driver and release him. Are you the one now to tell me when I'll release my prisoner? Prisoner? Mm -hmm. But it was a mistake and he has apologized. Wait a minute. You mean you woke me up from my sweet sleep just to discuss that fool? <sniffs> Enough. I don't want to discuss that. He will remain there until I change my mind. For God's sake, girls. How can a full grown man pee on his trouser? Yeah! Oh! My dear! Some adults are like that. Mm hmm. Yeah! Maybe it's a sickness or something. Mm. Sickness, <laughs> kid. Forget it. But I heard he pleaded with the prince to let him ease himself. But the man refused. My dear, forget it. He could have told it when he gets to this place. Why saw the man's car with you in? Oh, I'm a bother. Kai, and where were you girls? 
Learn to concentrate on your jobs and leave gossips. When? I, I don't know what that young man did, but all I'm saying is that get him out immediately. But father, that guy is an idiot. I don't just like him. The mere sight of him irritates me. Oh, son, oh, son. You don't say this type of thing. You are going to be a king one day. And when time comes, your subjects expect you to be a calm and peace-loving king. Hmm? But this has nothing to do with my being a good king or not. Hmm. Okay, I've heard you. It's just that I don't like dollars. That guy is empty. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, just give the keys to the guys and let him be released at once, please. Okay, yeah, I'm heading. Aha, take. Have it. Good. The prince instructs that you thoroughly wash the interior and exterior of this car. The other two cars and the jeep. And that is the only condition you can get yourself out of this mess that you are into now. to serve you food, but we are not there. I figured that you'll be here. <laughs> Why are you crying? Is it because of the incident that happened yesterday? Forget it. We all know how the prince behaves. He disgraced me. <laughs> He humiliated me. <laughs> My fellow man, a man like me, doing that to me. Now all the maids in the palace now see me as a laughing stock. A fellow man like me. I understand, please. Forget it. Eh? I will talk to the maids. I will. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Just have it. Have this. Take this materials to my tailor, huh? Tell her I'll come pick them up on Friday, right? Yeah, yes, my princess. And um, that reminds me. I'm really sorry for what transpired between you and my brother the other day. I want you to please forget about it. And please, don't allow it to affect your job, right? Yes, my princess. You can go now. He sees me as a devil himself. Are you sure you didn't do anything to him? I did not do anything to him. You know, he just hates me. I noticed him from the very first day we went to pick him up from the airport. You know, my sight irritates him. It's okay. Oh. It's well, okay? Everything will be fine. Okay? So, by the way, where were you going? The princess sent me on my own. Okay. Mm. Why do you wish to do this? No, you have to start going so that you don't keep her waiting. I have to come and see you. It's okay, I'm fine. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Mm -hmm. I'll see you in the night. Uh -huh. Take care of Hi! What do we have here? 
Barbara, you're back. Yes, I'm back. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Welcome. Thank you. So, where's everybody? Um, I guess Betty should be in the throne room. And Obi? I guess he should be upstairs. Okay, let me see him. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> so how's everyone at home? Mom is cool. Mm. My kid brother is on holiday, so he's home. Good, good. How did your discussion go? Smooth. Hmm? Mm -hmm. They said you and your people can come anytime you're ready. How can we get going? I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> oh, please, are you kidding me? Mm. At this time of the night? Sure, 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 sure. I can't wait. I can't wait. Come on, I can't wait. I can't wait too, but come on. I'm excited about this news, you know. I can't wait to mm. be around. Mm. 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 As you know, her father is late. All she has got now is her mom and kid brother. But she told me that they discussed with their uncles and they said we are ready to come anytime we choose. Oh, that's very good. <laughs> I'm so happy for you. <laughs> I'm so happy. Then, when do you want us to go? It's your decision to make that. My decision? Yes, ma'am. Um, one market week from today. One market week? One market week. As in four days? Yeah. Wow, I'm excited. I'm counting my days. I'm counting mm -hmm. my days. You know? <laughs> but you know we are going to have... You know, this is a toast to our evergreen relationship. Uh-huh. To our traditional marriage coming up in a few weeks' time. Uh -huh. And of course, a toast to our born babies. Wow. As you see, I can do it. Do you know we are actually alone in this house now? Really? So, what do you have in mind? We don't need the bed for anything now. I should think so. Oh, you're looking very hot this evening. Just like you are here. <laughs> Him down. Here we go. This is the list of items we need to shop for this week and um, probably next week. 24 cows, mm -hmm. 50 bags of rice, yeah. 30 cooling vans. Oh, yes. Come on. What do you need all this for? <laughs> for my only brother's stretch now, marriage, of course. Amara, please stop exaggerating. This is too much. It is a marriage, not a festival. The marriage of the future queen of this clan is not just. Fab is a great occasion which must happen once in a lifetime. So my dear, mm. this event is more than a festival to me. And my brother is the one and only prince of this clan. You know what? Amara. Mm-hmm. But wait. But seriously, you know me, I'm not a loud person. But for this, I'll go louder. Like seriously? Should we add anything? Like seriously? <laughs> Please. <laughs> My fellow cabinet chiefs, we all know the issue on the ground. 
The princess marriage is coming up few nights from now. Each and every one of us here represents each community in this kingdom. So we all have been assigned the duty of taking charge of all the foods, the drinks that each community will take that day. <laughs> That's all right. Reverend Sister Akwaniko. By this time tomorrow, we all are going to meet with the wedding planner to know how to go about our duty. Um, uh, my cabinet uh, members and elders, I thank you and I appreciate the interest you've shown on this matter so far. But one thing, I wouldn't like anybody, any son or daughter of this community to complain of food or drink. If you take good care of everybody, you should be taken good care of. Hmm? Because I've provided everything, food, drink, and whatever, even souvenirs. Igwe! Hey! Igwe You need to see the, pre the preparation for this marriage. The way I'm seeing it, it is going to be the best marriage, the best marriage ever around this area. Obim, you don't have to tell me. I mean, just imagining it alone. Hey! Wow. Being the only child of a king. That wedding will sure be explosive. I know. Okay, so that, that is why I brought you this money, okay? So you can go to the market and buy yourself a beautiful dress hmm. eh, that you wear on that day. Thank you. When will you come and give her money to shop and buy things for her own marriage? Rebecca, you're welcome. Hey, my friend, don't welcome me. Go out there and make money like your mates and stop deceiving my sister. Rebecca, why are you talking like this? Eh? Ego and I, we have great plans for, 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 for ourselves. I am not deceiving your sister. Hey, save me those explanations, my friend. I know you've had these plans since you are a child. And if at this stage you've not achieved any of them, I advise you think twice. Hey, my friend, shut up! Let me talk to this fool. One second. I'm your future in law. Mama, what ah. is it that troubles you, my Mama. son? I don't blame Emeka. I do not blame Emeka at all. If not for poverty, if not for Obia, Obia, will a little boy, why she, she, a boy I watched grow up. Be comfortable to insult me. Me, if I hit you, Mama. Hey, God. Come, 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 my son. Come, my son. Sit down. My son, this life is like a mirror. Hmm. What you sow, you must reap. Mama, I know. Mama, I know. I know, but I just wish. I just wish that God would give me a little money. A little money to teach this boy a lesson. Teach him a very good lesson, Mama. A little boy insult me. Hey! Get again on any way, God. Are you alive? Thank you, Mom. What you should pray for is that God will bless you. Hey, if God blesses you, my son, eh, you will be able to live up to your responsibilities. I'm not a maker, my son. Eh? Oh. Hey, hey, son. Come hey Mama. 
Why she is she a little boy? I watched God insult me. Hey God. My son, God will remember you one day. Mm. Mm -hmm. You won't die in this suffering. He hey. must remember you. He must remember you, my son. Um, take this to my wife and sister at the mall that you dropped them yesterday. And this time, make sure you don't pee in my car. Yes, my friends. Oh, shut up. Don't print me. Keep moving. Ego, 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 mama ni bagua. Um, my son, where are we with the arrangement? If you ask me, on my side, everything is perfect. What is remaining for me now is to sit down, relax, and wait for the D day. Oh, that's very good. That's very good. Um, to you ladies, where are we? Um, Father, as my brother said, we are set in our own wing. Um, we've made every necessary arrangement down to the very least. <sighs> I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Yes, Your Majesty. Everything is in order, thanks to Amara and my mother. Oh, that's fantastic. That's fantastic. Thank you very much for all your efforts. In that case, I will now retire. Now. Satisfied. Thank you. Oh, yeah. My fellow mates, I called for this meeting to discuss a very important issue. We all know that the king is celebrating the marriage ceremony of his son in a few days. And because of his affluence in the state, an unimaginable crowd will be here to celebrate with us, friends and foes. So we need to be on our guard and make sure that nothing goes wrong that day. And as well, respect ourselves. And you know what that means? To avoid having our jobs on the line. So later this evening, the princess will be here to assign to each and every one of us our duty for that day. So for now, we can as well return to our various duties. But before then, make sure that you pass the information across to the other maids in the palace. Thank you.
Happy today that Obina has got a wife, and I have to appreciate and thank all of you for making it possible. I thank also members of my family, the, the rare captives, the public, the musicians, all those all of you that took part in this ceremony. I remain grateful to you. So you relax and enjoy yourself. There are a lot, a lot of drinks, food. And everything is in surplus, even seven nights. Thank you very much, my people. Thank you.
spelling of our village, Amankwa. A, me, a, we, Good evening, my princess. Good evening, ma. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Um, if I, I can see you're really enjoying yourself. <laughs> yes, but well, small, small. Uh, my princess, uh, let me introduce uh, to you my my fiance. Her name is Ego. Mm. Ego, you're welcome. Excuse me. Um, if I come with me to the store, let me give you something for you. Hmm. Excuse me. You're welcome. Thank you. Brother, mm -hmm. the wedding was beautiful. If you see what our people were doing there, I mean, they actually just embarrassed themselves. Like Mama Obina brought 50 liters of empty jerry can and she turned every available drink that she could find inside that can. And I also saw some people putting meat and rice inside their bag. Like seriously. <laughs> Brother, I will not lie to you. I had fun. Everybody had fun. Everybody. It was so nice. Oh. Ha! <laughs> people of Amangwa and their long truth. I won't say it's long truth, you know? Because everything was in excess. People had to eat, that's why it was there. Our people ran away from food. Can you beat that? Anyway, that is true. The, the number of cows and drinks the royal household provided for this occasion are all over the local government. I even got five glass plates as thanks for coming. Yeah, their money is good though. Thanks for coming for a wedding that I was practically not even invited for. You had fun though. Oh yes, yes. Everything was good. I know. They spent a lot of money. Just like a dream wedding. Uh -huh. Something you just see in movies. Baby bicycle. What am I gonna do? 
I brought it as my wedding present to you and your wife. As in, I'm a kid. Or I have kids yet. You see why I say you're senseless? Man, move this rubbish out of here! Baby, this is a prayer for us to have children. There's nothing wrong with it. If I thank you very much, please, let me have it. Bring it here. Thank you. Let me have it. What was that you did outside? Baby, I should be asking you that. What did you do that for? I mean, the young man meant no harm. Listen, wifey. This should be the last time you disrespect me in public. And this should be the very last time you teach my staff to be rude to me. Oh no, baby, I did no such thing. And I have no intentions of doing anything like that ever. Sweetie, I just felt you were just unnecessarily hard on the young man. If I is a good man. I hate that name. And as long as he remains my subject. I can treat him in whatever manner I deem fit. Ba 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 baby! This is crazy. How can you just hit someone that has done nothing wrong to you? My dear, I have never seen a case like this before. I mean, good day, my princess. Oh, good day, babe. Thank you. I mean, the man has done him no wrong, but he still treats him as if the man killed his wife. But that's not nice. It's not nice at all. I mean, we are all human. He should not treat him like trash. It's really unacceptable. Did I just hear you say trash? Trash or slave? My brother has practically turned an innocent man to a slave. But why? Why is he doing that? No, this is not nice. It's not nice. Oh. Seriously, I, I don't get it. I don't. My Prince, Your Majesty, today is the 14th day after your marriage. And I and the Council of Elders have decided to honor you with the bracelet of authority, which entitles you to ascend the throne as the king in the event of a or the past known or the present king, which is my humble self. You will live long, Your Majesty. Thank you, my prince. You may kneel. Odogu. Uh, I came to drop the car keys. 
can drop it on the tray. Hey, single. Hi, bro. Good day, my prince. My, my prince. What do you have in that bag? My clothes. So what are your clothes doing in my living room? <coughs> Obi, if I in here came to drop the keys for the week. Drop the keys for the week? Today is Friday. How do you know? Yeah. If I had a special of period proved by father, because he got a sick mother back home. So what has that got to do with his duty in this palace as a driver? And look, that his off period, whatever, has to be reviewed. Because he cannot be different from the other staff. That will be discriminatory and very unacceptable to me. Mr. Man, you pick those keys. Go out there and clean that jeep very well because tomorrow morning you're taking my wife to the village first thing um, Obi the man is on break and as you can see he's on his way you heard me Except you are no longer interested in this job. I'm sorry. Right? You know how my brother behaves at times. I'm sorry. Yes, sir. I'm gonna miss you, baby. I'm gonna miss you too. <laughs> mm. Take care of yourself, yeah? Right. Okay. Madimba Beko, Ochideko, Okulo Dili. Madimba Beko, Ochireko, Oriba Riri. Madimba Beko, Ochideko, Oba Ba Ba Ba. Everything is okay. Really? Yeah, actually they've been very, very nice to me. In fact, mom, they are nice people. Mm, that's good. Mom, it's just that sometimes Obina acts very strange. Strange? Yeah. How do you mean? I think there's something he's hiding from me. Mom, I, I think there's something between Obina and the driver. You mean the same driver that brought you here? Yes, Mom. Obina has sworn that over his dead body, will he live to see a smile on the guy's face? And each time I try to talk to him about it, he picks on me. This is serious, but have you tried asking him what the problem is? Mom, I don't think there's anything. And even if there is, do you think he's going to tell me? Yes. Just ask him, okay? Hmm? I think you should. Huh? <laughs> you say sorry, you know. Uh -uh. <laughs> Mommy! That's my baby. <laughs> you look very good. You're looking younger. Hey, I hear you. <laughs> well, this is nice. I'm with you. Okay, okay. I'll give it to you. My okay. mama love. <laughs>
Greetings, Your Highness. Who are you? And what do you want? My name is Ego, and I'm here to see my fiance. Your fiance? Who is he? If I the driver. Oh. Well, he's not around now. Let me drop you. Madim Babu Ego, 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 Ego. Mama ni Babu. Madim Babu Ifo Jinaka. My princess, I swear, I swear, I swear, my princess, I have never met the prince all my life. Before I even go to the palace, never. Even after I go to the palace, I don't know what I did. We have, we had no problem at all, no problem. This whole thing started from the very first day we went to the airport to pick him up. He just hates me. He doesn't want to see my face. No, it's okay. He doesn't like me. It's okay. Hmm. I believe you, at least for now. But if I find out that you lied to me today, believe you me, my hatred for you will surpass that of my husband. My princess, I swear, I swear, all I've told is nothing but the truth. Nothing but the truth. Nothing but. It's okay, you don't have to swear. Just concentrate and let's go. Um. I don't know what I did. I wish I could just leave this job and go. Oh, come on, I said, I said it's okay. It's okay. Madim Babu Ego, 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 Ego. Mama ni Babwa. Madim Babu Ifo Jinaka, Ifo Bunisi, Ife Dena Baya. Madim Babu Ego, Ego, Ego. Madim Babu Ego, Ochi Ego, Obulo Dili. Madim Babu Ego, Ochi Ego, Ori Barere. Madim Babu Ego, Ochi Ego, Oba Ba Ba Ba. Madim Babu Ego, Ochi Ego, Bolu Sawa. Madim. Thank you very much, Your Highness. Thank you. Um, can I have your number so I can call you? I don't have a phone. Oh, I see. Um, I'll come to see you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much for the work. Brother, good evening. Who was that man I saw you with? Oh, that's um, Prince um, Obina. Which Prince Obina? Aini's his boss. And where did you meet him? I went to the palace to see Aini and then he was not around so he just said that he would help me and drop me around. So you mean to say the Prince of Amanko came to drop my sister and on top of that Give her money. Yes, I've been thinking maybe we can use it to do all those things that we did not do before, all those leaking things in the roof. Yeah. At least we can change what's in the house. Jide, Jide, I'm you? going to the shop. I will meet you at home. Yeah? Okay. Why don't you take some money from here and don't tell worry, the carpenter to do that leaking thing now? Nah? That's not leaking. Don't leak worry, when you go home, just give it out. Okay. Yeah? All right, brother. All right. I beg you, I beg you in the name of God, okay? She needs this money so badly to attend to a very pressing problem. And I've already promised I was going to give it to her. And I have it. But unfortunately, that's... That stupid prince cancelled my off day. So I could not get the money across to her. Please help me. But you know that I can't leave the palace now. I can't leave the palace now. It's late. Why can't you leave it tomorrow on my way to the market? I will stop by and give it to her. Why? Nekai, it will be late then. That is my fear. 
Yeah, it might be late what she needs the money for. But wait, that reminds me. She was here today. Can we? Here? In the palace? Yeah. So what happened? But the prince attended to her. The prince attended to her? Of course. Did the prince walk her out of the palace? No. Oh, thank God. But he was on his way out when she came, and the prince decided to give her a ride. Did he? She entered the prince? Of course. You, she entered the prince's car. You saw? I did. Ego, my ego. Ego, ego, he bonged. I want my challenge, I could see in a demo. One ego, he bonged. I love Panama, ego, he bonged. I want to take the car uh, to the mechanics and fix the fault he developed on my way back. Mechanic? Yes. At this time? Can't you wait till tomorrow? It's already late. My queen? No. Please. The prince might want to use the car. And I will not want him to see the car in that state. Please. Eh? Let me quickly rush to the mechanics and fix it, please, before he sees it, please. Okay. Just make sure you come back before he returns. I will. And I suppose um, 5,000 Naira should be enough. Okay. Come back before he returns. I will. Thank you. Ego, my ego. Ego, ego, he won't I actually got the money on. I got the money, but that stupid idiot prince man asked me to take his wife to, to, to her village. We're just coming back, you know. And when I got to the palace, they told me you came. I came to the palace yesterday, but the prince told me that you traveled. He even was kind enough to drop me at home and he gave me some money. He did what? Give he gave you some money. What for? Nothing. Just give me. Ha. Huh. Obi, you mean you collected money from somebody that hates me so so much? Treats me as if I'm nobody? You collected money from him? I didn't beg him for the money. He just gave it to me. Where's the money? Go and bring it and return it back to him. My brother took it. Who, your brother did what? I don't like this. I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm telling you. Sorry, Obi. I don't like it. I Sorry. don't like it. Let this not happen again. Barbara. 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 My baby. Now, where is my most expensive car? Uh, I sent the driver to the mechanic with it. Just pray he comes back with that car unscratched. Because I will not only yell at you, but I'm going to tell you something nasty. Come on. You only asked my permission to go face the car. How was I supposed to know you're not going to come back this early? Save your explanations and just pray. <sighs> hey, hey, come here, come here. Where in the name of God did you go with my car? Uh, to the mechanics. Oh. You went on an exile with my car. My most expensive car. And you stand there yelling and looking at me! I'm sorry, I'm sorry my prince, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry for your miserable life. Will you drop those keys before I give you a dirty slap? I'm sorry, okay? 
Mamadi Mbabu Eko 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 Mamani Bagwa Mamadi Mbabu Ifo Jinaka Ifo Bunisi Ife Dina Baya Mamadi Mbabu Eko 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 Mamadi Um, once more, my son, I say welcome to your fatherland. Thank you very much, sir. Now, tell me exactly when you entered this country. Um, that should be on Monday, Your Highness. Actually, my plane landed at Abuja on Monday evening. I went straight home to grace my parents' uh, 30th anniversary. Mm -hmm. Then I decided to come down here today. Okay, you did very well. You are welcome once more. Thank you. Um, Amara. Yes, thank you. Uh, have you prepared a decent room for him upstairs? Um, yeah. Um, actually, Your Highness, I, um, I checked into a hotel room 35 minutes ago when I came down here. How can you check into a hotel room when I have emotions here? Actually, Your Highness, I never thought it would offend you. Of course you did. You see, apart from the fact that you're uh, you are, you are going to marry my only daughter. We are father, Senator Mwapo, and I grew up together as best of friends. And uh, it's unacceptable for his only son to be in my kingdom and he will not be under my immediate care. It would never repeat itself again, Your Highness. I promise. All right. Okay. Um, Amara. Please, I can check if this food is ready. assisting me right from my Jesus tree. And we agreed to marry each other. Come on, be smart. Your name is Ego Money. Get if you may marry with a man in Eji Ego. What are you doing with a man that doesn't have money? That guy is not only dumb, but he has nothing to offer you. He has no future. What do you want from me? an opportunity to care for you, to buy you everything you want. I mean, to make you the happiest woman on earth. You're married. Who says the future king of our man poor is not entitled to two things? If you really want to take me out, you have to come and see my elder brother. I don't go out without his permission and 
I don't want him to start looking for me. Madim Babu Ifo Jinaka Ifo Bunisi Ife Dinapaya Madim Babu Ego We have here Wow Dennis, my God. <laughs> Good to see you bro You're welcome my guy What have you been eating? Eba and Onubu soup Wow It's as though you're going to blow up in split of seconds <laughs> All thanks to Babu You can say that again <laughs> so when did you arrive? Um, that was like an, an hour ago. Oh, that's nice. You're welcome. Thanks, thanks, bro. Thanks, man. Where are you guys off to? Um, <laughs> I, I, I want to see him off to the hotel. Hotel? Yes. Man, what are we doing with all the spaces here? Man, you should be staying here. What are you doing at the hotel? Um, well, he says he wants to stay. Keep quiet, you. Anyway, <laughs> good to see you again, bro. All right, good to see you again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no problem. <laughs> If I knew my good in law, how are you? I'm fine, you're welcome. Thank you, a nice business. Uh, as you can see, we are doing it. Hey, well, and yours? <laughs> well, you can see, <laughs> we're pushing it small, small. Good, good, good. Uh, please, um, <clears throat> how about uh, Ego Ibo? Is she at home? No. Ah, Ego Ibo has traveled to Onicha. What? Traveled to Onicha? But she did not tell me. Oh, yes, it was a matter of urgency. Um, my late mother's younger brother, daughter, who live um, with her husband in Onicha, has just put to bed. And then um, Ego had to run to her aid. Hey, would she have told me? Um, actually, she, she wanted to come and see you because she was crying when I escorted her to the park. Oh. Yeah, but she didn't have a phone now. She would oh. have called you. Oh. Uh -huh. But she have uh, still told me or oh, look for a way to tell me. Please, Emeka, mm -hmm. that's your auntie, the one she went to see in Onicha. Does she have a telephone or an address where I can visit her? If I you don't have to bother about that now, yeah? Will you abandon your job just to travel because of a woman? Emeka, I can't, no, I can't. Well, I don't know where to help you on that one. Ego, my ego. Ego, 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 ego. A wama chalancha, a kuchi nyele mo Mwana busomba, ego yibo nkebo Ala pokwa na maka o, ego yibo nkebo Ego, mwaki ego Ego, ego yibo nkebo you shine like a diamond ring when I'm with you I feel like a king my only angel Love of my life When I get the money I will make you my wife Ego, ego Mwak ego Ego, ego Ibo nkebo Akwamwa chalacha Akuchi ngelomo Mwak 
what I've been telling you about. You are a very beautiful woman who deserves nothing but the best. Hey! 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 Is this you? How are you? What are you doing here? I should be the one asking you because you just disappeared without letting me know. Um, I'm sorry. The news of my, my auntie's and child's death just got to me and it just broke me down. I just ran. Death? Yeah. 
But your brother Emeka told me that uh, your aunt put to bed and called you to come and help her. That's what you told me. We're saying the same thing. The child died after birth. Oh, I was sorry, eh? Mm. Oh. So are you back now or fully or you're still going back? No, I'm not. I mean, the child is dead now, so we don't need a nanny anymore. Hey, oh, sorry, eh? Sorry. Sorry, eh? Thank you. Sorry. Meanwhile, you're looking very beautiful. Eh? <laughs> Ego Ibo. Sweetie, mm. how do you feel now? Still very tired. Baby, are you sure you don't want me to cancel this trip and stay with you? I'll be fine. You have to go. Because your mother is waiting for you. Yeah, I really wish you were coming with me. I wish I could too. But don't worry. If I will drop you safely. Okay. Are you really sure you can stay by yourself? I've taken my medicine. It's okay. I'll be fine. Okay, if you insist, let me go and dress up and get going. Anything that will upset him. Hmm? Do whatever he asks of you and make me proud, okay? He's only inviting me out for ice cream. Nothing else. Okay. But just heed my advice, just in case. <laughs> Madim babu ifo jinaka ifo bunisi ife dena baya Madim babu ego 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 Madim babu ego oji dego okulo dili Madim babu ego baby. How was your trip? It was good, thank you. And how is your health? I'm fine now. Mm, I can see you're really fine. So how is your mom? She's fine. She sends her love. Okay, veteran. He's okay. Okay, glad to have you back. Emmy, I miss you. <laughs> you really look good. Thank you. So what are you Hello. drinking? I'm really thirsty. Uh, this is very hard. Okay. I'll call these uh, guys to get you some. But I can take so. it and get hot. For you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let him get me something. Uh -huh. Yeah, you there? Yeah. Ego Ibo. Ego Ibo. Ego. Ego. Ego, Ego. Ego, Ego. Ego.
Ego. Ego, Igor. Ego, Igor. Ego, Igor. Ego. I cannot believe that Ego Yibom, my Ego, have not been here to see you in a week. Mama, this is the same Ego that frequents this place every day. No day passes that Ego does not come here to see you. This is the same Ego we are talking about. Mama. My son. Mm. She might be busy in her classroom. Mama, that is not an excuse. But make good that. Biko, don't say this again. The ego Yibo that I know, ego Yibo has changed. The way she dresses has changed. Her manners has changed. Ihenile basere ego e changele. Everything about ego has changed. Mama, such that I've, I'm even scared. I'm afraid. I fear for our relationship. Mm. Mm. Oh, okay. Hi! Ego. Ego, you walk on this woman. I don't know. She will change. Mm, Mama. Become yeah. Mama, not the ego I'm seeing. Become Mama. Become. It is not my ego. She will change, eh? She is not. Mm. Mm. It was a mistake. It won't happen again, I swear. Obina, oh, listen. I'm not asking you to kneel down here and make promises. All I'm saying is, whatever it is you have with that girl, be it lost or love, I don't care. But I want you to put a stop to it. Because the next time I spot you guys one inch close to each other again, believe me. I will let lose my mouth. Not only will I tell you why, but also your in-laws. Hey, come on, baby, sis. That's too harsh. Come on. Don't patronize me. Because I'm that serious. Let that ugly incident of yesterday never repeat itself ever again. I'm sorry. Oh, please save it. Because that's what I feel for you right now. Excuse me.
prisons. You can leave us. Yes, my princess. Uh, you sent for me. Yes, I did. Um, actually, I was wondering. Are you still with that fiancé of yours? The one you introduced to me on my brother's wedding day? Yes, my princess. We're still together. So tell me, how close are you guys? We're very close. I am even thinking of uh, going to pay her bride price very soon. Okay. And um, that is to say you love her. I love her very much, my princess. Okay. One more thing. What's that her name again? Her name is Wakego. But I, I call her Ego Yibom. My, my wealth. Ego Yibom. Yes. Okay. You can now go. Thank you very much, my princess. Space. Your marriage is barely six months, and you're acting as if he's ten years old. Mm. Amara, do you want me to carry your brother on my head? Come on, I know that our marriage is new, and I pamper it. Well, I don't think you do. Seriously. Wait a sec. Why do I have this feeling that you're saying all this because of your love for Kate? How do you mean? Uh, maybe because I'm not pregnant yet, you know, you African people, pregnancy, pregnancy, maybe I'm not pregnant yet. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Anyways, and that too. Girlfriend, what are we waiting for? Let us fill this whole palace with cakes, you know? <laughs> really? Yeah. Now, where's your boyfriend? Dennis. In the hotel, right? What are you doing here? Meet him. Do the thing and start getting pregnant. And I promise I'm going to meet you. You're not serious. No, no, we need to fill this company with Kate. And Let's you go. know my brother, he's the first child, so him first. Oh, please. What of you first? Please. Start having kids, I'll follow suit. Meet your boyfriend at the hotel. Do you want me to escort you? I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Don't have kids. Let's oh have my kids. God. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. I no, I won't do that. I will not. Who was that? Okay, looks like he's in his Who did you just speak to on the phone? A girl. Obina. You just spoke to a girl. Call her back and prove to me. But there's nothing between you two. Do you understand? Let me just go. Hey! Call her back. I want to talk to her. Prove to me that there's nothing. Or let me let me have your phone. Please! What's going on? Open that. Open that. Let, let me have your phone. What's going over you? What's going over you? What's going over me? I want to go and sleep. What's, what's the problem? Remember! No. Call, call the person back. Prove to me. Or else you will not move out of this place. Look. I will not have rest in this house. No, ask your brother. Hey. Don't listen to me when you see me. Let today be the very last time you ever call my brother's phone. I took my time to come here to warn you because I want to be sure that I advise you myself to avoid limbs. Because the next time I see you 20 inch close to my brother, believe me, I'll put every single hair on your scalp. Stupid girl! 
Instead of you to settle down with the man that loves you, you're here chasing shadows. Idiot. Let me never come back here. Ah. Ego, what are you doing here? I thought I asked you to stay at the shop till I finish with this bike. Eh? No, this is the problem you have. You always eat too much. So it is because of hunger you locked my shop and came home. Anyway, you have to change. Because this is not a good attribute for a future queen of our people. My point, brother, I am tired of daydreaming about being a queen. I want to go back to Ifani. I want to go back to happiness. What nonsense are you talking about? Who is Ifani? Look, the prince is married. No matter how we try to deny that fact, he is married. He has a wife, okay? His sister came to the shop today. She threatened me that if I don't leave her brother, she's going to kill me. She will kill you. Why would she do that? Why? Is it, is it, is it your fault that you're so beautiful that her brother cannot let you go? Brother, she was serious. Madam Babu ego, 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 what do you mean? I'm pregnant. Pregnant? For who? For who? You didn't take anything. After that day, we did something. How could you be so careless? I'm sorry. You didn't tell me to take anything. And I didn't know. Else, I would have asked my brother for something. Come. Hope you didn't tell your brother we did anything that day. Hey. This girl is a woman. What? 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 Hey. Oh my God. Oh. With all due respect, my prince, I refuse to discuss the untimely death of my only sister. I mean, how, how can you ever suggest that? Or is it because we are poor? Emeka, don't talk like that. I really like your sister and you know it. It's just that, as the crown prince, it will not be wise for my first child to come out of wedlock. And who is talking about out of wedlock? Who is talking about producing a bastard? Listen, my prince, it's either you get married to my sister as soon as possible, or I will announce our little secret to the whole world. Has it served? Mm. What's the matter? Why are you like this? No, nothing. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm alright. What were you saying? I said, breakfast is served. Oh. I'm actually starving. Then let's go before the food gets cold. Barbara. 
Yes, baby. Do you know I love you? Yeah, and I love you too. Go. <laughs> Igwe Ichin, I greet you, my fathers. Young man, who are you? And why are you here? Igwe, my name is Emeko Okoro. I am a native of this clan, and I am here to see you. Young man, didn't the guards tell you that I'm having a one-on-one -on -one meeting with the king? They did, my father. They did? Then why budget on us? I mean, what is it on this planet Earth that you came for that couldn't wait until after our meetings? I'm sorry, my fathers. What I came for is urgent and needs urgent attention before Let's things fall apart. Oh, then speak up, let us see. Speak, just speak. Hey, young man, what is it that you want to say? Speak up, let us hear you. Igwe Ichie. Please, it's about the prince. Hmm? The prince has been deceiving my sister for some time now. And each time I try to complain, he will threaten to deal with me if I do not stay clear. But right now I can't anymore. Because I just found out that my sister is pregnant for him. And he's planning to abort the pregnancy. Hello. Mbani. You are a disgrace, young man. I mean, a disgrace. Yes. I mean, how can you explain your promiscuity? How can you explain it a few months after your marriage? I'm sorry, Dad. I'm really sorry. I regret my actions. It was a mistake. You are right. It's a mistake. You are right. It's a mistake. And a very expensive mistake. Very expensive. And you're going to pay dearly for it. Because. You know the cost of it. Daddy, you have to do something. My marriage is still too young to survive post oh, Please! You should have thought about that before going after another man's woman. Another man's woman, you say? What do you mean? Father, the girl in question is Ivan's fiancée. Which is fine. Be fine, your humble driver, whom your son detests so much. Oh my God! You mean you've been frustrating the driver all this while because you wanted his woman? Jeez! Okay. You were so pathetic. Place the devil walking. Baby, please say something. I'm sorry. I beg of you, forgive me. Please. Sorry, but I have to let you know that your supposed fiance has been having an affair with my brother. My princess, uh, that can't be possible. And why, if I may ask? Because Ego Ibom and I are in love, and she promised never to hurt me. She also promised me 
that she will be mine and mine alone forever. Well, I guess she lied. Because as I speak to you, she is pregnant for the prince. That can be true. Because my ego Yibo is a virgin. And we both agreed to keep it that way until our wedding night. Okay. Then why don't you confront her and see if I'm lying or not? Excuse me. Ego, my ego. Ego. Ego ibo nge mo Akwama chalacha akuchi nyele mo Mwadabu soma Ego ibo nge mo Alapo kwa na makao Ego ibo nge mo You see why you always have to respect and obey my instructions? I mean for the first time you obeyed and listened to me you're about to become the queen of Amanko village. Brother, I always listen. It's just that your advice comes as trouble sometimes. Absolutely. Mm. Thank you. Ego Ibu. Thank God you're here. I went to the shop and I made the shop locked. And I was wondering where you are. How are you? Ibu, how are you? Are you okay? Does she look sick to you? Rebecca, please, allow me to talk to my woman, please. I want to talk to her alone. Hey, are you all right? How are you? There's this rumor. This rumor that's been speculated everywhere, even in the palace. Eh? What rumor? What foolish rumor are you talking about? My wealth, my jewel, Obiotom. I don't know her. I don't know how. Uh, this rumor has it that you are having an affair with the prince. That wicked prince. That idiot. That stupid man. But you know what? I told them it's a lie. That they don't know you. I'm the one that knows you. I know you very well. That it can't be true. They're even saying that you're pregnant for you. Yeah, they are fine. We've heard what you said. And everything you heard is true. My sister is pregnant for the prince. How do you mean, Rebecca? I simply mean everything you had is true. Ranging from the relationship down to the pregnancy are all true. Obi. 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 Obi, say something! Talk to me now. Tell me it's not true. Bia, 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 I find you, Bia. Leave my compound. Get up. My dear, go in. Listen, let me tell you something. Leave my family alone. Leave my sister alone. Leave my compound now. Okay. Yeah, why? Okay. Go inside. Get inside! Obi, Obi, please, Obi. If you're done, you know your way out. To my fellow man, because of poverty. Because of poverty. How can I, after laboring, another man comes to reap? Tell me, Baba. Hey. Why you going on? God knows why. Hmm? Who knows? Maybe Ego Ibo would not be a good wife in the future. Chilaba, so if she's not a good wife to me, how can she then be a good wife to a wicked prince? 
for me, Baba. Tell me. Where am I going to find another woman? As good as my ego Ibo. Tell me. If I need to woman. Why are you mad? Ego. Eh? There are good women out there. God will give you another one. Eh? One that will be better than Ego Ibo. Hey girl. It's okay. Hey girl. You know? Hey girl. You know? Hey girl. Stop crying, my son. Hey Stop crying, my son. Hey no. I can't take this anymore. I can't stay with some guy who I do everything to make happy yet does not appreciate me. No, I can't. Maybe. What exactly do you mean by that? I go back to the UK, get a job. And start my life all over again. But what does that define you as? What does that make you? A queen who could not stand the taste of time by fighting for what rightfully has? A queen who prefers to lose her home to one silly girl that is not anywhere her class. Baby, come on, we can do better than that, okay? Do better than what? Do better than what exactly? That barely six months after I got married to your brother, he impregnated another woman. I can't. Baby, believe me, you understand how you feel. I swear I do. You have to calm down, okay? Don't allow that wicked to rejoice over you. I beg you, don't allow that stupid girl to rejoice over you, alright? Amara, you don't understand. You don't. You don't know how I feel. You don't know how I feel. No, you don't. Please stop. I'm sorry. Leave me like this. <laughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> My people, there's no need beating around the bush because we all know the solution to this problem. Which is? Prince. Have to marry the girl. Whether much or much or him, or you didn't know me, God didn't know all of them. I will tell you. But my fellow chiefs, we all know that the prince has married. Not just married, but newly married. Uh, when did it become a crime for a prince to have more than one wife? What I'm saying is that if the prince wants to take the second wife, that is being a polygamy. Mm -hmm. We have to follow our custom and tradition. He has to become the king first, then he can marry as that many wives as he can. I tell you, people, now, sister Apagigo, how do you expect that girl to get give birth? You and I know that it's a taboo for a royalty to born outside the palace. <gasps> sister Apagigo. My chiefs. What is our conclusion? Igwe, Ndichie, Prince, have to take care of the girl. Till she delivered. When he become king, he can marry her fully. Oyo batra lu te ya ya, o wunu gasi ya erikule. Mba no, mba. Sister, akwaniko. Thank you very much. Madim Babu ego, 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 
Then you listen to me and listen real good. There's a limit to what I can take from you and your mistress. If she must remain in this palace, let her be in the guest room. Obina, is it not enough that your wife must share you with her? Must she also share her bed with her? Fine, if the tradition demands she stays here until she puts to bed, good. Then you go downstairs and get a room, or even in the servants' quarters. Exactly. Exactly. After all, he has a way of sharing things with his subjects. Everything will be all right. No, Nega. I can't stand this anymore. I can't. I'll just quit this job and just go away. Go away. The shape is too much for me. I can't stand it. So you want to leave your job for a woman who is not worth your pain? Or you go and commit suicide? For a woman who will not even notice. Oh, come on, Ifani. You stay back and face your fears. Stay back. Mommy, <laughs> Madim Babu Ego 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 Madim Babu Ego Oh Chidego Oh Bulo Dili Madim Babu Ego Oh Chidego Oh Ribariri Madim Babu Ego Oh Chidego Oh Baba Like hell I have to I thought I could cope with all this shit but right now I give up Like seriously I quit Let's just wait until he comes back. Let us see his reaction. Are you kidding me? You think I give a shit about that dude you call your brother? I don't ever want to set my eyes on him again. In fact, he can go to hell for Okay, fine. What about father? You know how much he loves you. Could you at least wait for him to come back? Amara. He loves me and I love him too. You understand me? The more reason I want to leave here before he, his stupid, useless son pushes me into committing murder. Do you understand me? My brother, you are calling Steve Paul. <laughs> Babu ego, 
to you. Where is Barbara? If you're looking for your wife, you check the guest room. But if you're looking for Barbara, your ex-wife, I advise you catch the next flight to UK. And God help you when you find her. What's the meaning of uh, next flight, UK, guest room, whatever? Simple. Barbara is no longer interested in the marriage and she has traveled back to UK. I take that as an expensive joke. <laughs> you can ask the palace aid, but better still ask the man whose wife you stole. He was the one that dropped her off at the airport. Okay, if I conspired with my wife to run away from me. Okay, now I can get it. If I if I if I Where's my wife? I don't know. You don't know? Yes. Well, you dropped her at the airport. Uh, uh, okay, so it was a conspiracy, eh? No, no, no. No! She told me you dropped her and you're lying! Uh, yes! Okay. My prince. Uh, my prince. Uh, yes! Yeah, no, my prince. Take this man. Strike him! I'm following you. Come on, buddy! Come on, buddy! Come on, buddy! Come on, buddy! This is Remove his dress! Remove his shirt! John, get! 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 I just drove the car. Strike this man. Please, please, I'm sorry. I know where I dropped her. Strike him! I know where I dropped her. Remove his shirt! I remember this nonsense! My friends, I know where. Eight! I know where I dropped her, please. Yes, 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 yes. Where is the dollar that went for the canes? Where is that dollar that went for the canes? Please, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Where is that? Egg? I'm sorry. Shh. I'm sorry, my please. Don't be that. Stop. What's wrong with you? Can you imagine this idiot helping my wife to escape from me? No, oh, Your Highness, no. You're fine. Stand up, stand up. Guys, help him stand up. Bring him up. I can't go through your highness. They told me to go and drop out the airport. That's all I did. Eh? <laughs> he has not started flogging me yet. Who gave you this mark? Huh? Where did you get it? Okay. Your Highness, I've always had it when I was a little boy. Ah. Hey! For five years, I lived with my husband without a miscarriage, let alone a child. Until the gods brought Hifa Ichuku into our lives.
I took him home. And after treatment from I and my husband, he regained consciousness. He could not remember anything about himself. So we saw him as a silence from the gods for our childlessness and named him Ifan Yuchuku. Five months later, my husband died, leaving I and I Yuchuku. Hey! Anyway, the girls are not asleep. Igwe, sister Akwaiko. Oh, Bize, my son. You sure you will go without me? Yes, my lord. I really don't have much to do out there. Just a few minutes with the doctor and I'll stop by and pick up the boys from school. So, uh, in one hour or two, I will expect it, my queen and my soldiers. Of course, my lord. Okay. Take My king, the accident was a very fatal accident, which led to the death of the driver and of the queen. But we tried all our possible best to deliver our pregnancy. But my king, I'm sorry, what? we lost your queen. What? What are you just suggest? What's my queen? My king. I'm sorry, my king. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, my king. Doctor, how about the newborn baby and the boys? The newborn baby is uh, in the incubator. But as for the boy, he is in the ICU. The queen was in the car with two of her sons. Mm. Uh, sir, the rescue team brought in three casualties. The queen, mm -hmm. the driver, and the little boy. Just these three casualties. Nobody else. I'm sorry, my king. Please, I'm sorry. You see, from that day, the doctor confirmed that my son, Obinze, the crown prince, the one with a mark, a back mark, given by the gods, was missing. I sent out such parties. And for three whole weeks, they combed and looked for my namesake, my first son, Odinze. And uh, from that day, the doctor confirmed that uh, my son, Obinze, the crown prince, the one with a birthmark given to him by the gods, was missing. I sent out such parties to comb the area looking for my first son, my namesake, Obinze. All the effort were abortive. I mourn 
I endured believing that my wife and my first son are no more. Little did I expect, little did I know that he is alive and healthy. The gods are not asleep. Thank God. Thank God. Oh, gods of our land, glory be unto thy name. Oh, Binze. It's true we are here today for a reunion. My father has talked sense into me. And I've realized that maltreating a man just because he's not of the same class with you is not good. We must all realize that we are children from same parents. My brother. Every mad treatment <laughs> towards you. I'm sorry. For blood's sake, forgive me. It's all right. I want you to understand that every bad thing that happens to us happens for good. If I can't forgive you, who will I forgive? <laughs> God, God brought me to the palace. He positioned me here to discover my roots. My brother, I forgive you. <laughs> it's okay. I forgive you. I forgive you. I forgive you. It's okay. I forgive you. <laughs> I'm sorry for everything that I've done wrong. I'm sorry for hurting you. I'm sorry for everything. All I ask for you is to bless this union. The deed has already been done. Come on, rise. Come on. Please bless us, please. It's all right. Come on, in. I had already forgiven you before you asked. Okay? If you are what my brother truly desires, I give you both my blessing. Okay? I give you my blessing. Okay? I bless you. You know what? From henceforth, nothing will ever come between us. No man. No woman, no living thing or dead will ever come between us. Not in this world. Not in the world to come. Whatever I have in my life, I share it with you. It's not even the best. Please. No, 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 no. You keep, I mean, no, you keep one, okay? You're going to keep this. You keep this one, okay? It's okay. I bless this day. I bless this day. Thanks be to ancestors. Come together, my children. Come together. Mm. Oh! 
Ruhe. Ego, 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 